Hey guys, welcome to my video. For today's tutorial, I will be teaching you how to make the crochet alpine stitch. To begin, all you're going to need is some yarn and a crochet hook. For this tutorial, you will need to know how to make chains, how to make the single crochet stitch, the double crochet stitch, and the front post double crochet stitch. I have videos on all of those and I will have them listed down below. Starting from the beginning, you're going to make an even number of chains, then add three chains. So I originally made 22 chains and I added three, totaling up to 25 chains on my hook. To start row one, you're going to make one double crochet into the fourth chain from your hook. You'll then make one double crochet into each chain across for your first row. And that's how row one is looking. To start row two, make one chain on your hook. Into the first stitch of your row, make one single crochet. Then into each stitch across, make one single crochet. And that's how row two is looking. To start row three, make two chains. For your first stitch, you're going to skip over row two. You're going to be working into the first stitch of row one. You're going to make a front post double crochet over this double crochet in row one. So that's how that's going to look into the next stitch of row two, you're gonna make a regular double crochet. Into the next stitch, you're also gonna be working into row one again. You're gonna be working into this corresponding double crochet down here. So you could see that it lines up with this stitch that you would normally be working into. So the one right below that, you're gonna be making another front post double crochet. So that's how that is looking. Into the next stitch, you're gonna make a regular double crochet. Into the next stitch, you're gonna be working into row one again, this double crochet right here, making a front post double crochet. Into the next stitch, you're gonna be making a regular double crochet. So you can see how these are looking so far. These are our regular double crochets. These raised ones are our front posts. Into the next stitch, you're gonna be working back into row one, into the next double crochet of row one. You're gonna be making a front post double crochet. And then into the next stitch, you're gonna be making a regular double crochet into row two. You would now repeat these steps until you reach the last stitch of your row.
When you reach the last stitch of your row, make one regular double crochet into that last stitch. And that's how row three is looking. To start row four, make one chain on your hook. Into the first stitch of your row, make one single crochet. You're now going to make one single crochet for each stitch across. And that's how row four is looking. To start row five, make two chains. This is going to be another front post double crochet row. So you can see on our last one, we started with the front post right here where it's raised, then our double crochet, front post, double crochet. You're now going to start with a regular double crochet into the first stitch. Then this time, instead of working into row one, you're gonna be working into row three, which was our front post double crochet, front post double crochet row. So you can see that we are now gonna make a front post double crochet into our next stitch, but it's gonna be worked into this double crochet right here from row three. So you're gonna skip over row four. You're gonna work into this double crochet right here from row three, making a front post double crochet. Into the next stitch, you're going to make a regular double crochet. Into the next stitch, you're going to work down here over this double crochet from row three, and you're going to make a front post double crochet. So you can see how it's looking. Over any previous front post from row three, we're making a regular double crochet on this row. Over any regular double crochet from row three, we're making a front post regular double over a previous front post, front post over a previous double. So we could see on this row down here, we have a front post, so we're gonna work a double crochet into our next stitch. We're now gonna work a front post double crochet over the previous double crochet in row three. Next, we're gonna work a regular double crochet into the next stitch. And you're going to repeat this until you reach the last stitch of your row. When you reach the end of your row, make one regular double crochet into the last stitch. And that is how row five is looking. To start row six, make one chain on your hook. Into the first stitch of your row, make one single crochet. Then make one single crochet into each stitch across.
And that's how row six is looking. You would now repeat rows three, four, five, and six in order for however long you want your project. I will have all of the rows timestamped down below so they are easy to reference back to. And that is going to be how to make the crochet alpine stitch. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Please like and subscribe for more from me. You can follow me on all social media at crochet me lovely, all one word. Please leave me any feedback down below for future videos and tutorials that you would like to see. Thank you guys so much for being here and have a great day.